Hi, I'm Patrick, and today we're checking out this really cool product called Split Volt from the company Split Volt, and we're going to talk all about it. So let's go. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Yeah. What's your name? Where? My, my name is Dan Liddell, and I'm with uh, founded a company called Split Volt, and we make the unique Split Volt splitter switch. And it's a device that lets you automatically and safely share your existing dryer circuit with your EV charging. So you can get fast home charging for your EV without having to pay an electrician to have another additional circuit put in. It uses your dryer circuit anytime the dryer is not running and it does it automatically. So it's automatic, like you don't have to like program. You don't have to do anything. Okay. You just plug it in, it takes you one minute to plug it in and then you immediately are fast charging your vehicle. And anytime someone uses the dryer, they just use the dryer and it will pause charging. And whenever the dryer's done, middle of the night or whenever, it automatically resumes charging. So it behaves like it's a dedicated circuit, but you're using a circuit you already have. So you didn't spend a thousand dollars to install a circuit. You didn't spend weeks with uh, coordinating with electrician. You didn't have to do permitting. It just works. You plug it in in one minute, anybody can do it. And if you don't have room on your panel to add another yeah. circuit, this is also great. That's exactly right. It's very common for homes to not have additional power available to run an extra circuit. And since this device automatically ensures that you're only running one or the other, you don't need any additional power. You don't have to run or upgrade right. your panels at all. Yep. And about how much do these run? About three hundred and fifty dollars. Three fifty. And yeah. uh, and it, you know it has a display screen. It's got an internal safety breaker, which is really important because um, the National Electric Code doesn't want you to charge at the full rate on an existing circuit. They want right. you to have a buffer to be safe. We ensure that automatically, so that people who use this don't have to pay attention to it. If they were to accidentally. Uh, pull too much charge to their vehicle, it would simply tri trip it here and protect. So there's really nothing that they have to very do. Cool. It's very safe and automatic. Yeah, and I know like a lot of people, uh, when they first get their EV, they're trying to get the most power into the car as quickly as they can. Yeah. I actually recommend, and this, and I do this repeatedly when we review chargers, I'm like, charge as slow as you can. I usually charge at like 24 amps, 32 yeah. amps, although the car can take more than that just because I don't need to and it's better for the battery, it's better for sure. the grid. Oh, there's just so many reasons to, to go lower power. So that's very cool. Well, you're making a really good point that 24 amp charging is plenty fast. That's about 21, 22 miles per hour. You can charge a long range EV no sweat overnight, even if you drained it all the way down. Now, yeah. most people don't drive 300 miles in a day or 250 right. miles in a day. But the point is, even if you did, it's still gonna be able to charge your car in a day, right? So so that's plenty, right? And uh, that works great. So that's a standard 30 amp circuit. Right? Yeah, and that, so that's exactly what we do is we always de-rate. De and then the other thing is, is like, and we've talked about this um, in some of our other videos, we're looking at getting a second EV and this can help out with that as well, right? Yeah, absolutely. In fact, you this device is designed not only to as one option, let you share your existing dryer circuit with your EV automatically. But instead, if you have a circuit already installed, you can use it to charge two EVs, dual EV charging. You just plug two EVs into it. And when the first EV is done charging, the other one would automatically charge. Nice. So in the morning, someone's not like, oh, I forgot to switch over. Was it my turn or your turn? Yeah. Both cars are fully charged uh, automatically overnight. So it works great for dual car to share one existing circuit too. Sounds like a great solution. Um, we're very interested in it. We are looking at getting our second EV. So great. we're gonna definitely be checking this out. Um, I know that this is like one of the most common questions we get is like, like how much does it cost to get charging? And then of course they've already ordered a car and they're like, it's like $1,500 right. to get another circuit. But in this case, this is about $350. $350. You can order it from our website. You can also order it from Amazon. The website's a little bit better and quicker, but the yeah. point is for $350, you can in one, one minute plug it in and you're running you're instead of having scheduling someone for three weeks and getting permits done and spending a thousand dollars or fifteen hundred dollars or more right. to get power it's just there because if your dryer works it will work you don't have to do anything anybody can plug it in very cool well thanks so much for sharing this with us today i know a lot of people will be interested in it thanks so much thanks for your time patrick i appreciate it all right very nice meeting you.